Alright, welcome to Urtuk the Desolation. This is the full release and very first thing. Thank you developers for fixing this and giving me sound options that are more than just 50%. Um, we're gonna go with our sand volume at 20%. Okay, saving close. We're gonna start a campaign. And last time we played the default setup with Priest, Guardian, and Berserker. Uh, just to be different, let's see what our other options are from the Priest. Assassin's pretty good, but I'm not sure that's who we should have. Uh, what is the Blood... Lifesteal Strike. Yeah. Light and Deadly, great at flanking enemies and disabling threats. Can equip Greatsword. Okay, so that's one. Uh, what's the War Monk do? A swift, defense-focused character able to divert enemies to self. That sounds like a bad idea for our guy that actually needs to survive. Uh, footman we know, Hunter we know, Berserker, Spearman's good, Priest... Ugh, I'm tempted to just go with the Priest because he's already got the mutation thing on him. Uh, come on, be different, right? Be different. Be different. Go with a Blood Knight. Okay, so we'll have Urtuk. Uh, I guess I can't rename my guys. Maybe not. Okay. Uh, I am going with the Guardian and Berserker combo, because I think these are two really good combos. We may die horribly picking this instead of a Priest, but... Uh, let's see. We can take the Greatsword. Oh, that changes based on... Yeah. Okay, uh, Brilliant Mind. Uh, boost Concentration... Okay. Uh, I really want Critical Counter-Strike. I liked that from last time. Action Man. Not crazy. Improviser... Uh, when maximum focused, apply focus ability to self if applicable once per turn. Uh, silver helmet, silver sword, silver shield, silver big axe, brilliant mind. Uh, hmm. When maximum focused, extra medicines. We can go with the silver great sword. Well, maybe we should go with silver shield. Alright, we'll take the silver shield. Yeah. All right, let's go. We're going adventure difficulty. Let's go. And we'll take a glance at the tutorial. In a dim prison. Uh, we can skip that part. You guys have seen the tutorial. Come on. You're not you're not watching this for the first time, are you? This on my channel. If you are, uh welcome. Thank you. Yeah, this looks the same. Let's skip the intro. All right. As Ertuk, you were imprisoned deep below ground in the sanatorium. For many years, the corrupt alchemists conducted hideous experiments on your body. As a result, you have suffered a deadly mutation. Now, finally, you've escaped the underground and must undertake a perilous journey in search of the cure for your affliction. You don't know its exact location, so you need to look for clues in the villages. After you take them over in this zone, the Badlands, you must fight your way through the scavengers, ragtag gangs of bandits and thugs lurking in ambush for unwary travelers. Also remember that medicine needed to heal injuries is extremely rare and can only be purchased in the black market. Well, here's Urtuk. Some deserters, namely Rithin the Blood Knight. Oh man, we already have a Blood Knight, right? Yeah. Dang it, I didn't want to get a double. Uh, are being chased by... Air healed and his bounty hunters. They've been spotted to the north of your current location. Party size two. Well, that's where we're starting now. A group of soldiers have surrounded a smaller group of soldiers and are about to strike. Let's engage. Okay. Uh, deployment. You can deploy up to six characters. That's correct. I'll show you guys deployment. You don't need to. We don't need to read through that, do we? Yeah. Damn it. Why am I getting a duplicate character? That's really lame. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with it anyway. So they're going to come around here. I mean, unless they want to walk through the spikes. You guys be my guest if you do. You're going to move first. You move third. You move second. Alright, so you go there. You go there. Start the battle. Please help us. Those bloody bounty hunters want our heads. Uh, stay out of this, wanderers. We were hired to kill these deserters, and that's just what we're going to do. Moo hoo ha ha ha. Okay, Bounty Hunter. After we finish up our contract, let's eliminate these travelers as well. I suspect they've got some tasty valuables. Oh. Ho ho, indeed. So you have the jump strike, which is pretty cool. I am the battle advisor. I know. Okay. Move up there. It does penalize our speed. That's fine. Uh, end your turn. Oh, damn it. I forgot to equip my mutators. Okay, well, I've already screwed this up. Haha! <laughs> -ha! 
Let's move you here. Off you go. Like I said, I don't think they have any choice but to come up this way. Okay. here. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Go for it. There we go. Damage blocked by armor. Uh, we'll read this one because it's a good refresher. Um... Some items like chainmail helmets and shields have the armor protection attribute. Characters protected in this way mitigate incoming attack damage, receiving only half damage and negating negative status effects. After each attack, armor protection is reduced by armor damage, uh, an amount concurrent with the attacking weapon's armor shatter attribute. Uh, once armor protection is reduced to zero, it has been broken and negative status effects will be applied. Every piece of armor has a protection value and when less than 50% is left, it will slowly flicker red. When at zero, the flickering is doubled, the armor's protection Regenerates a 25% rate per turn. Okay. Height advantage. Good job. Yes, height gives you extra damage. What? How dare you? You won't live to see another dawn. Well, let's go ahead and do it. Zone of control. We know what zone of control is, don't we? Range, stunned, or panicked characters do not have it. Nice. Oh, but he's going to counterattack because he took no... no he shouldn't. Maybe he gets his ability. Okay, out of breath. So weird. You can't move anymore. Sound has gotten weird on me. Um, if you want, go ahead and attack him and kill him. Okay. Maybe we should turn the sound down just a little bit more. Alright, that'll do. Okay, what do we want to do? Do you want to charge in? I say, no you don't. He's going to attack my barb. That's okay, that's okay. Hmm, I'd like to... You know what, let's just go here and backstab. Watch this. 89 crit because we backstabbed. Uh, automatic critical hit. It occurs if one of your allies is occupying the opposite hex. Okay. Let's do... Do I not have life steal attack? That's strange. Okay. Well then just attack him. And you'll kill him. Yeah, I know. There we go. Okay, we need to do better next time. That was a sloppy fight. And now we've rescued somebody who's the exact same as what we already have. That's kind of annoying. Uh, we did get a steel helmet. Okay. Trillium and life essence, but we don't have enough to... That would be awesome. Uh, okay, but we don't have enough to extract these. Uh, let's actually set up our troops, huh? <laughs> okay, critical counter strike. Yeah. Um, steel helmet. You guys just attack with those. Okay. Okay. Uh, do we need an iron helmet? I'm guessing we don't. So we'll just get the resources for it. Uh, last stand. I will put last stand on you. Okay. There we go. Uh, troubled mercenary. The spearman. Uh, war monk. Or. Uh, scavengers. Normal. Easy. Shall we get the war monk first, then do this, then hit this? Uh. Okay, let's do this one, it's easy. Help them. Okay. So, significantly larger number of troops this time. Okay. I've 
we've fallen upon dire circumstances. Can you aid us against these savages? We've already set some traps. They will only harm the enemy. It's safe for you to walk over them. Well, let's get moving. One problem is I don't know which one is Urtuk and which one isn't. They need to add uh, something like Darkest Dungeon where you can change the color palettes on a few of them. Otherwise, I'm going to make some terrible mistake where I mistake which one is Urtuk. <laughs> so this guy I hate. <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> that's all I have to say about that. All right. Jump to the enemy and attack. Must be in direct line of sight. Min range 2. Range 3. Costs 50 stamina. Uh, okay, go for it. I thought you had a blood attack, but I guess I'm wrong. You can also do the leap attack. Nope, you can't. i have you wait. Have you move here? Oh, damn. I, I can bash him in there. Is he immune to bash? We need to check that first. Okay. Immobilize and critical, stunning blow, attack, swap, retaliate. Oh, that's why he always attacks back. Okay. He's not. We are going to bash him in. And he's dead. Right? I think so. No! Jabril is down. I'm not going to die with him. Oh, that was the wrong choice, my friend. Okay. Can you do a leap it you can. Well let's just do a leap attack. Awesome. I would like you to do this. Uh blood strength, shred armor, improviser, light foot. Okay, he doesn't counterattack. That's what I'm mainly concerned with. So I'm gonna move you here. You can get your attack in. Oh, he does counter. God damn it. Wow, why is he... Maybe they've changed it, but usually you don't counterattack unless your armor protects. So, that's why I'm a little surprised. Can't. Can you move here and then do a leap? You can do a leap attack on that. Okay, try it. He'll bleed out. Um... I'm going to move you here. And we're going to do shield ally. Okay, we have to do it on him. Oh, he's retreating good. Yep, he's dead. Good, he attacked the barb. And now the barb's going to critical counter strike. Oh, but he's out of breath. Damn it! Damn my eyes. Alright, well... Nope, that's not going to work. 50 stamina. 40 stamina. We should probably just move then. Not, not quite enough. This'll do it. Uh huh. That'll work. Okay, that's damage. <laughs> Alright, you are gonna wait. Okay. I'm gonna move you guys back. Uh, I'm gonna have you wait. I'm gonna move you back. Okay, you can't get down because obviously this is two levels lower. Okay. Oh, is that, is that how we're going to do it, huh? Watch me leap. Oh, I can't, huh? You wait one sec. Wait, I want to put the shield up first. Oh, we can't do a leap attack. Alright, well... Alright. Get out of there, buddy. Get 
out of range. Okay, this will work. No damage. Uh-huh. Can we get up here? Thank you. That's helpful. He's not going to be able to range attack you with... Well, I'm going to wait still. Oh, he's still coming for you. Damn. Okay. You're still doing shield ally. Not that it matters too much. That works. Critical counter strike, but you're out of breath. Of course you are. That's okay. No damage. You see why I like the knights, aren't you? Alright, buddy. Just get out of there. Don't die. I don't want you to get wounded already. Okay. It doesn't matter. You're going to die anyway. I'll move you there. You'll be fine, as long as you survive. Mm -hmm. That'll kill you. Again, not exactly expertly done. Thank you. If you hadn't come, we would have perished for sure. We're adventurers, and one of us would like to accompany you on your journey. I will definitely take a hunter and a steel sword. Awesome. Okay, now is when we get stuff. Bleeding criticals, I would like to get. Uh, vigor criticals, 14%. 14 bonus speed. Can't afford those, who cares? Light foot is also good. Uh, let's get bleeding criticals first. Can we afford? We can't afford anything else. Okay. But our barbarian went up in level. Steel greatsword. Iron greatsword. Oh, well, damn it. Equip your good stuff. What's wrong with you? Okay. Iron. Iron. Yep. Okay, get rid of the iron stuff. We don't need it. Okay. You were going to take the bleeding criticals. Okay. And we're going to level you up. Uh, I'm going to do what I normally do, which is one of strength, vitality, and agility. Okay. Looks good. Not creating medicine. We're fine. Okay. Uh, real quick, maybe go a little long, but we're going to grab the uh, spearmen. And then we'll start taking over some villages. You want to take these over sooner than later because they will, over time, increase in population. Okay, during your travels you hear talk of a secret entrance to a huge swamp cavern located in one of the villages. We should keep an eye out for that village because the cure for Urtuk will probably not be found in this zone. Okay, let's do the troubled mercenary. Looking the situation over, you see some mercenaries fighting scavengers. The scavengers are advancing quickly, and they seem to have the stronger party. Help them! Alright. Where are they? That is indeed a stronger party, but they do not have any range units. And we've got a couple. Uh, you can go there. You guys are fast, huh? Okay, let's start the battle. You found me. Good. Please kill these brutes. I was hired to slay their master, but failed. I am wounded and unable to fight. My friends are no match for the enemy. If I survive this battle, I'll offer you my services. We have already set some traps, and they are the only a danger to the enemy. Uh, it's safe for your party to walk over them. Okay. So you got traps over here. If you go over here, yeah, let's move you here. Shall we toss a trap? Let's toss a trap. Alright, you can wait. Alright, let's, let's move our jumpers over here. Our paratroopers. Okay. Uh, I wish you moved more, but I understand why you can't. So we'll do that. Wish I had light foot for you, but I don't. So you're going to just do that. Alright. These guys are a big problem. I only have a 75% hit chance on him because he's 
obscured by this guy. One thing about this game, I'm going to say it immediately, no RNG. The only RNG is in these situations, well, there's some RNG with some of the quirks you get, but the only RNG for basic attacks is if you have blocked line of sight for arrows. Uh, makes this a very, very good game, uh, frankly. Okay, just hang tight. Go ahead and wait. Uh, you can move here. And wait. You are going to move here. Shield ally. Now, the reason why it's good for the knight to be here is that any unit that moves into this space, I can bash into the barricade, where I wouldn't be able to do that if I'd position him where the barbarian was. Oh, but he's... Ah, oh, it's okay. He got trapped by the... Got triggered by the track. Mobilized. Okay. Can I? No. So how do I want to? I can move you up. I'm not sure. Let's move here. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Uh huh. This is gonna be tough. Actually, can we go here and then do? Oh no, he's gonna want to leap attack there. Mmm. Okay. Uh, let's get this guy down. Oh no, I didn't see the friendly fire. Okay. I'm surprised I missed that. Good. We're gonna just go here and do the backstab, I think. Not good for striking. But this should do it. Oh, okay, he's out of breath. That's why he doesn't get to. He's out of breath because he's out of stamina. Okay. If I leap attack, you're going to go there. Alright. If I go here, I can do a leap attack backstab. I really think we ought to try to kill that guy with the barb, or we can do we can kill him instantly doing this. And now he's bleeding. Not that it matters, because now he's splat. Fifty percent. Do not do that again. <laughs> there you go. That's the right way to do it. He'd be dead by now if I hadn't screwed up the other. Now he's dead now. So. Okay. Uh, you're a bit wounded, so I'm going to bring you back. Alright. Let's shield... ally. I'm going to move you back down to here. And wait. Okay, that's painful. move here. Nope. Move here. Alright, now try it. Okay. Again. I'm going to move you here. Wait. Thank you, I need some help. Shield ally. Okay. Critical counter strike. Nice. 
This will do it. That's what we need to do because this guy's coming around. Uh, yep. Mm. Ah, he can't block because he got out of breath. That's unfortunate. Right. Uh, <clears throat> we should probably not. I don't know that leaping makes a difference to attack damage, so we're going to do this. Okay. Thank you. Appreciated. That's not good. And he's going to get backstabbed if I don't kill this guy. Thankfully, we're going to be able to. Oh, thank God. I'm going to move you here. Let's just backstab him. Oh, nice. Why did you... Oh, because you're an ally. That's right. It was your turn to move, basically. 100% heal a hit. And we did it. Victory! Uh, a silver great sword and a spearman. I owe you my life. Here's hoping I will serve you better than those who hired me. Indeed. Thick skin. Uh, preparation on melee. Normal critical attack. Add retaliation buff. Uh, improviser when maximum focus is reached. Yeah, we know that one. Fast thinker. Can't do it. Uh, I do like light foot. I do like thick skin. Uh, preparation on melee. Normal critical hit. I believe that's all of... I don't believe that's three different. I mean, that has to be a normal melee critical hit. Like a single critical hit that's normal and melee. Add retaliation buff. I'm not crazy about that. I am... I do like Lightfoot. Okay. We're going to put Lightfoot on you. Silver Great Sword on you. And we'll junk that. All right, Rithin. Strength, vitality, and agility? Okay, that's your focus ability. That's right. Your focus ability is last stand. Okay, I think, actually, life steal is good. Shield ally, I'm not as crazy about. Uh, rend armor, definitely not as crazy about. Let's do last stand on... Well, but how often are you going to get to it? You have concentration four, which makes me think you'll... But you don't attack as much. That's the thing, is you gain focus by attacking and taking damage. Ah, uh, I don't know. We'll start with it on you and see how it goes. There we go. Looks good to me so far. All right, well, guys, that's uh, episode one of Urtuk, now in full release today. Um, I'll be doing some more of this in the future. I liked this game in early access. Uh, I Well, I guess it technically is still in early access, but anyway... Um, yeah, I look forward to seeing you again. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.